everybody. We're back. It's amazing to just watch this thing because it takes so long to chop down this whole field worth of trees. Yeah. Honestly, I wonder how much energy we're using to do that. Uh, <laughs> well, we could just recycle it on a single loop back through on the biofuel and see if it's enough to keep up with it. Right. That'd be kind of funny if it wasn't. If it couldn't even produce enough energy to run itself. Yeah. That'd be pretty bad. Ugh. But, let me see. What else did I need to work on here? Power we had an issue with, and I'm trying to remember why we started running out of power. Was it because space power got... No, it's because the laser oh. drill. The laser oh, yeah, drill's not I... even on. No, I was going to say, I forgot I turned it off, too, because it kept draining all the power. Yeah. So I wonder what will happen now if we turn it on. Um, glory. Energy mode. I mean, we still haven't End recovered energy. from running out of power before we started recording, even. So we'll definitely still run back out, right? I would assume so. I think I just turned this thing back on. Let me see. No. Wait, I have energy sending, item sending, oh, energy's receiving, there we go. There we go, energy receiving, now the laser drill is on again. How quickly will this destroy our surplus? I mean, that power's not going anywhere either down there. Uh, no, no, but how much will it, is it going to, how quickly is it going to destroy the surplus of what we already have? Right. Since these batteries are for the most part empty. Uh, the resident energy cells are actually still going up. Which I'm kind of impressed with. Because this is what quarry power is, right? Yeah. But yeah, it's still good to go. Okay. So it's an oxygen sealer that... Uh, versus the bubble distributor, correct. I'm assuming correct. By having an assumption of what you're trying to say. I guess what you, that's what you can put like multiple of and eventually however many you have is what you need. Yes. But they're still pretty broken. Uh, they're a little bit buggy. I need myself a door to get to this thing. No. Oh, that's. I think that's what I needed. Is I needed more um, airlocks. Yes, you did. Oh, I forgot how hard it is to control this thing. Up here in space. Sit down. Sit down. There you go, buddy. Okay, so I have one airlock frame left. That is correct. So what did I need to make an airlock? Air. Air lock. There we go. The frames were compressed steel oxygen concentrators. The airlock controllers were meteoric iron and steel. So, meteoric iron... I remember we got a lot from the moon at one point, right? Or from the asteroid at one point. <clears throat> yeah, we have we have 200. It doesn't seem like that much. No, it's not. It's more than a little. <laughs> it is more. It's more than a little. Less than enough. And vastly lower than Trump's fortune. Oh wait, maybe not. All this crap, and then head to. I don't have any wood. I just put some into the uh, system. Oh, did you? Yeah. So some should be coming down toward you soon. I need to, I need to fill up my oxygen tank. It's been so long as I've been in space. Like I haven't done anything with my oxygen tank, and I can't access this thing anymore. What the fuck? Okay. 
Okay, how is this doing? Amazingly, these things are still increasing in their biofuel amounts. So that means we're not generating enough of them. Um, just that one barrel is. Look at the other one, it's going down. It's Remember we had that problem before where only one was... Well, we are maxed out. No, they were, they were both going up. Oh, were they? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they both definitely... Go. Well, that energy cell is actually maxed out. Now. Oh, right, 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 right. That's, why, so yeah, that's yeah, probably... Yeah. That's probably more of the reason. Yeah, the power has nowhere to go. <laughs> and amazingly, you can store it forever. Which, wouldn't that be nice if that was real life? Do what? To store power forever. Oh, right. And never have to worry about it, like, going away. Yeah, that would be nice. Be like, yep. Yeah. Started storing power since I was a kid. Decided not to, you know, save for retirement until later, but I store power all my life. <laughs> so now, now I don't have to spend that retirement money on power. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh my god, you have the little Mars rover controller guy over here. Oh, the the base for it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Can the Astro Miner base. Never put one in there, it would just eat our fucking base. <laughs> I'm going to try to look for... I need to get a waypoint, and this is astro asteroid uh, exit. What? what? Est I can't spell. Asteroid exit. There we go. Done. Asteroid. Sorry, my microphone tried to fall over on me. You what? Nothing. <laughs> You're talking about roids. No, I just said, I just because you like enunciated it so much, I was like, asteroid. <laughs> well, I was trying to spell it, and I was spelling it wrong. <laughs> Dude, did you send the miner through the middle of multiple asteroids over here? Are you a. What the heck? What do you mean? Either there's a big chunk air or something literally split this asteroid in half. Oh, it did so, that a couple times, remember? Where we were in there? It was like going through. Oh, no, I, I am at a chunk here, though. Oh. Okay. Because yeah, it, like, it like ate part of a couple of them or something like that. Yeah, it did eat part of a couple. Like, this is literally like the whole center strip of the asteroid is uh -huh. gone. So it's just a chunk area, though? It, yeah, it's just a chunk area. Gotcha. I was thinking like something came whipping through here. Oh, speaking of... <laughs> speaking of something coming whipping through here um what's the deal with you guys in the um hurricanes and stuff is that coming toward you uh supposedly are, are you that state of emergency yet or are they not sure uh i don't i don't i don't think we actually know whether or not it's gonna it's gonna come here or not yet um but i mean i don't live close enough to the coast that it's i mean it's it's normally pretty bad but it's not like you never it's get to like the point insane. where you're like boarding up the windows. The biggest concern uh, right now is the fact it's been raining so much recently, like a lot, a lot. Th that the ground is already soaked and yeah, the trees could fall e more easily. Gotcha. That's yeah. I just was the biggest concern is the tree falling on my house. I was just reading some articles today, not realizing how th that it might turn this way. And of course, everybody here, you know, it's all about. Is this thing going to hit D.C.? And I was like, well, holy crap, if it hits D.C., it's going to hit the whole rest of the coast first. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, something that i uh, definitely worried about. I, mean, I, I, you know, I have a generator well, and stuff like that, so if it, even if it comes here, like I won't be without power. And then my, my, like I said, my biggest concern right now is just how wet this ground already is and whether or not a tree hits my house. I mean, did you guys get hit in the uh, the one a couple of years ago that tore through and took out a lot of you know New York and New Jersey and stuff? No, that one had turned. Uh, that one had, didn't hit us very hard because it it kind of came in after us, basically. The last big one. It's been several years since we had one that was like you know had like forty or fifty trees down around the house. Um, but even that one was uh we got lucky. None of the trees hit the house. 
Gotcha. So yeah, I figured you'd be in much more of a uh, a susceptible area than it most just of depends. Because we're still about two and a half hours from the coast. Trying to fly around on this asteroid here and find some more meteoric iron asteroid deposit. But so far, just a lot of monsters. Why is this not going on its own? What are you trying to make go? Um... I'm making basic wafers, and they should just automatically go. Go, go forth, young wafer. <laughs> it has not yet learned. It needs your guidance, dude. Go. I don't know why it's not going. Why is it not going, Jeff? <laughs> uh, I mean, it's just a young wafer. It's still sitting on the couch, out on his lawn. Oh, it's fuck. Yep. yep. <laughs> That's why. That's it's fuck. definitely the reason. <laughs> fuck. What'd you do? There's water in the way. There's water in the way? Yeah, it's back here where we, you know, we probably don't need to make um, smooth stone anymore anyways. I'm just going to get rid of that water. I mean, I don't know. How is there? There's water in the way of what? The cash. Like the cache, the, the basic wafer cache wasn't connected because that's where the water's at for the smooth stone generator downstairs. Okay. Yeah, there we go. It did this thing now. I'm proud of it. Little wafer grew up. Oh, yeah, um, let's see. Forgot to bring any, uh, any light source that works in space with me. I'm going to see if pyrothium will light up the. I bet the it will. surroundings. <laughs> I mean, we know it'll explode. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it does, and it burns. Holy, holy crap. <laughs> Apparently, it burns asteroid rock. Did not know that. It, That's amazing. But that it does do. Oh, this is an iron asteroid rock. That's weak. <laughs> this pyrothium is amazing. I love it. I'm gonna pour it on top of this asteroid <laughs> and let it spill down and kill everything. Whoa, that was weird. Dude, things are just ex like dying in this pyrothium so bad. <laughs> oh, it only flows like lava, though, huh? What do you mean by that? It only flows like a couple blocks. Oh, right, right. I was hoping it would flow more like uh, like water and take out just a ridiculous amount of things. Well, that's what we already came to. What do you need the wafers for? I'm just making a bunch of oxygen sealers. Be a meteoric rock. Okay, if I put you here, you should kill a bunch of people. <laughs> the creeper apparently just instantly blew up when he hit it. I don't know if that was coincidence or what. Huh. Uh huh. I wonder if it does make him just explode. Well, because well, I killed a couple of creepers on the other asteroid with it, and they did not do the same thing, but I literally put it down. He walked into it and just, no hiss, just boom. <laughs> and just boom. Just boom. <laughs> amazing. Man, some, of, some of these asteroids don't have a milky chocolate center. It's kind of sad. Yeah. I wonder if he's going to do more with that now that he's working on this again. Oh yeah, has anything come out? I don't think so. I haven't actually paid attention. I just knew he said he was working on it again. But I don't know what he's done, if anything. Maybe he's just a liar. He could be. 
<laughs> Did he kind of take you to direct, directly about it, or no? Co had tweeted saying he wished he was still working on it, and he replied to Co saying, "I am. So I just started again." <laughs> Maybe he got fired. <laughs> from himself? <laughs> no, from his other job. His new job. Maybe not, maybe his new job is now his old job. Oh, gotcha. I understand. The one that he was getting paid $8,000 a day for? Uh, I think it was an hour. Oh, an hour. Okay, that was an hour. I'm sorry. I, I don't keep up with other people's finances that much. <laughs> We're in a rock. Why do you not have anything good in it? You must have got real lucky to hit that one that had the uh, meteoric. Oh yeah, apparently it's so super quickly. rare from what people were saying. So good luck. <laughs> yeah, I did not know that when I started this mission. But it's probably still better than um, the alternative of going to the moon and sitting there twirling your fucking thumbs, <laughs> waiting for the stupid stuff to come. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to see if this really does make this dude. Oh, that was weird. Oh my god, it did! That's amazing. I dropped it from the ceiling and it definitely hit him and it just instantly exploded. That was cool. There is a ginormous crater in the middle of this asteroid now. <laughs> that was so cool. I want to do it again and again. These are not giving me anything that I want. Except for... Did I somehow make this pyrothium duplicate? Duplicate. Yeah, one of the first spots that I put this pyrothium is still, like, trailing off of the side of this asteroid. Is it like lava where sometimes it takes a really long time to go away? Uh, it could be. I don't know. Yeah, I just don't know enough about this. Well, like, what is this for except for the uh, smeltery? What? Anything? Oh, the what is it for anything? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Okay, here's some creepers. I feel like it's un used in some recipes. Creepers. Let's see. Hold on. Unsuspecting creepers. Where's the explosion? There it is! Oh, so cool. And it's weird, too, because it, it actually falls. Like, it, it doesn't... Even if, yeah, I think he blew up my source block. But even if you have a source block, it drops down. If it's in the sky. Hmm. But unfortunately my... Oh, no, I got it back. Yeah, there was a source block. Yep, and it was just trailing away to nothing. It's used in a couple recipes. Not a lot, oh, though. No. But it does make the... Uh... The smell tree super fucking fast. That's where okay. the case Or blowing up creepers from above. Well, yeah, asteroid. now that I know it does that, that seems like a pretty good use, too. <laughs> it, it is a pretty good use. You guys are just lining a layer of pyrothium like around your base, like a moat. <laughs> creepers just exploding. exploding. Iron. I don't want another one of these iron asteroids. You gonna dance at the marathon again this year? Huh, I mean, if that's what the people want. Okay. I still real. I still really wish I could play uh, Super Mario Maker though. Yeah. But I mean, take the good with the bad. Yeah, I think uh, I think the payoff is worth it. Yeah. No, I agree. It would just be a lot of fun. Yeah, I agree. Uh, are we going to do a Space Chicken segment? 
We could. If you want. Um, I don't know what all the segments are, actually. Yeah, yeah. I was, was going to say, neither do I. I need to get on the, uh, on the list and see what's going on there because it's been a little off the radar lately. Yeah, we're still kind of working out all of those, honestly. No, I'm definitely, I'm super excited for it, though. Um, I think it's going to be a good time, no matter, no matter what. And I think it's for, you know, such a good cause that it'll be fantastic. Yeah, I wish you could join us at, um, in Orlando for the uh, thing. The one that was a couple of months ago? Yeah, the, um... Like the Extra Life United event in Orlando. Right. Yeah. No, that would have been a lot of fun too, but it's just so much traveling in such a short time frame. It's so hard for me to pull off. Oh, yeah. No, I understand for sure. Now that Sevedus doesn't want to do um, booths anymore, um, I guess I'm done with conventions, actually. Well, you know, I thought it was kind of funny because, you know, we've been to PAX Prime every year for the last multiple years and I completely didn't even realize it was PAX Prime weekend. Oh until, really? Wow. Until I saw a tweet from somebody at PAX or excuse me, PAX West. Oh right. Um, right. Don't get it right now. Until I saw a tweet from somebody at PAX and I was like, oh shit, that was this weekend. Huh. Oh well. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. I'm right there with you. I thought I was going to really miss it actually. Like because I mean, I I did know it was when it was happening. I was like, oh, it's gonna be it's gonna be sad, but it did not care at all. Uh, you know, one thing I will admit that I was sad about is there was not a big bucket of seafood dumped on a table in front of me. I I actually said that to Crystal. I was like, man, the one thing I'm gonna miss is uh, going and having giant seafood buff buffet or not buffet, but uh, boil. I mean, it, it might as well have been a buffet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's. I don't think we came close to finishing at all. Eat the best parts. Like, always leave behind, like, some shrimp and stuff. But definitely always eat the the crab and all that. But yeah, yeah, it's my... It's, that's really the... Really don't even need to go to, to PAX. I just want to go seafood boil. Yes. Yes. I mean, I'd be all about going to, like, PAX East. Because it's so close. <laughs> right. I mean, yeah... I don't know. Like, we'd already paid for a house and everything at PAX South. I just canceled it. Bill Knight? Right. When, was PAX, when is PAX South? Uh, it's January. Oh, wow. I guess, it, yeah, I guess it is coming up pretty soon. Did you pay for the same house and then cancel it? Yep. It's going to be the same house again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is Illman Knight? I don't know. I don't either, but I found some. Get rid of you. Try to get some of this. Aluminite. Uh, I think that might just be aluminum. Uh. It says it's called ilmenite ore. And it gives me... Oh, it looks like it gives me aluminum and iron shards. Hmm. Why? What? What? No, that's not aluminum that's giving me. What the hell is it giving me? Maybe it's titanium shards I'm getting? And? Oh yeah, it's titanium and iron shards. What's a titanium shard for? To make titanium. Oh, there you have it. Is titanium good for anything? Uh, I think we needed it to make the that miner or something like that, but yeah, not really. I see. Yeah, compressed titanium seems to be the only thing you can make from it. You make titanium chest plates, titanium pickaxe, titanium tools, heavy rocket fins. Okay, so you need titanium for that, or the walkways. What are the walkways? What are the walkways? Walkways with the walkway oxygen pipes? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, that sounds short range telepads? Oh, I know about hey, that. Hey, stop stop burning me, man. 
I might, uh, stop burning me, I said. Stupid pyrothium. There, I might, uh, harvest some of this titanium. I think we have some. I mean, I guess we have a lot of stuff upstairs, too, that have come in from the, uh... Oh, you yeah. You're right. Do we get meteoric iron from that? I don't think so. Let's see here. Because that would be pretty cool. Right. No, because it's all ores, right? So I don't think... Well, um, well, um, it was mete it was meteoric ore here, wasn't it? Yeah, we have titanium, nether titanium ore. There's... Nether titanium, how much? Like uh, more of it than I would need to be messing around with this thing. Not so decent amount. Yeah, I kind of want to see what these walkways are all about now. Because can you no. make like? No. No, we don't have. <laughs> <laughs> you had asked if we had uh, the other thing, and the answer is uh, no. Just, just no, okay, Jeff? No. Just no. Nope. I'm not not allowed to know nope. what the walkways are like. Nope. Uh, nope. It's you will not. Rules. I don't know what I was thinking. I apologize for you're, asking. You're a fool. <laughs> Getting all the stuffs. I don't know why I'm still collecting this titanium while saying that I don't need it anymore. Um, I really... We're out of time, too. Oh. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed me going through a bunch of... <laughs> right? <asteroids. laughs> All I've done is make... I uh, made some oxygen sealers. I got them now. Um, <laughs> Next episode, oxygen collectors. <laughs> oh, no, we don't need those, because you made the thing. That's true, but I mean, just something mundane to make. Oh, okay. Maybe uh, maybe oxygen unsealers. Unse Ooh. <laughs> All right, see you guys. All right, see you.